What's the chow chin chows? Nanto Joe here. Welcome back to another episode of the Pokemon Scarlet Nuzlocke. In the last episode, we made it to Amazonia and we also sadly lost a Pokemon in our uh, Jaywitz the Hopip after it had been so good. But sadly, we lost the Pokemon, so we don't get to keep it. But we're here back in Condorado. Uh, we're going to uh, continue. We're going to go and take on the gym right here in Condorado and see if we can beat that. But before I do that, I want to go and see if this is, this is Area 2, isn't it? Yeah, this is South Providence Area 2. That's still South Providence Area 2. Oh, I I need to find a way how we can define routes. Like, ladies and gentlemen, we, I need your help to help me define routes. In this game, because the routes are so expansive and you can go into a town and then you can come back out of the town and then you're still on, a route, you're still on the exact same route. So, I need a way to define routes. If you guys can help me define routes, please, please do it in the comment section. I need to know. I need to know where I can get new Pokemon. And I can't just, like, wait for the area thing to come up. I thought, like, that would still be a thing. But no, it seems routes are still uh, are very expansive in this game. Oh, hey, Joanne. Uh, came to this gym, huh? Uh, that can only mean one thing. You're ready to earn some gym badges and take on the Pokemon League, aren't you? Uh, yeah. Yes, I knew it. I was so glad I asked you to do it. Before you can battle the gym, you need to pass one of the gym tests. Uh, there are certain challenges set by the gym, uh, by the gym leader. Every gym test is different. If you ask the man at the lobby, uh, he'll give you some... Uh, he'll tell you about it. Here... Yeah, these are for you. Uh, consider them a present for me for, he for healing up your Pokemon. Super potions! Thank you! I'm so glad you're aiming to be a champion too. That's the best news ever! Man, I'm so excited. I can barely stand still. I guess I'll have to battle more... Sh every just battle every train I run into. Alright, you do go and do that. I'm going to go and take on this gym test. Welcome to Condorado. Hey, y'all. Welcome to Condorado Gym. Let me register you as a challenger. Your name is Joanne? Yeah? S Great. Now, in order uh, for you to challenge gym leader Katie, uh, you'll need to pass a gym test first. Here at Condorado Gym, which, uh, that means you'll be taking on the Olive Roll. Olive production is a big part of Condorado. We've held the Olive Harvest Festival here every year for generations to usher in a bumper... Uh, in, uh, to usher in bumper crops. To pass the gym test, you'll need to roll an olive-shaped ball all the way to the goal. Your efforts uh, should help ensure a great olive, uh, olive festival this year too. The staffer over at the olive rolling field will explain this in more detail. I'll register, you, I'll register the location on your map now. It's to the north of town. Take part in the olive roll. Okay, let's go and do exactly that. Let's go and roll an olive.
Is this where I need to be to uh, roll an olive? Welcome to the olive rolling fields. This gym test is about stamina. You'll need to push uh, with all your might to this large olive. Earth ball roll, uh, rolling to make it to the end. Get through various obstacles and then push through to the goal. You ready to start the gym test? Yes, I am. Let's do this. Great. Put it. Uh, uh, put in a wish uh, for for a good olive harvest and roll, roll, roll away. Gym test. Take on the olive rolling challenge. Okay, so I gotta get it all the way over to there. I mean, apparently, if you use uh, your if you use your bike, it gets a hell of a lot easier. From what I've heard, anyway. We don't know too much about this, but from what I've heard... It can get easier if you roll your bike. If you use your bike. It's weird how this is an olive rolling thing. This is a... Usually this would be... Bug type gym, if anything, I, from what I remember. I mean, I've literally just nudged it to the goal area. No, let's fight. Let's fight a gym lead. Let's fight some gym trainers. Let's fight some gym trainers. Let's fight the. Uh, let's fight this girl. I mean, technically, I can already score a goal, but I'm ready. Uh, incinerate. Cooked. Cricketoon is on the menu tonight. Yes, I made it past your small olive wall. No, I don't want to give up. I do want to put Salt Bay up front uh, for this next battle, though. Because, you know, bugs don't like rocks. I wouldn't do this normally. It's just, I feel like it's just... I want to give this a try. Salt Bay, I want to see, see what you can do. Ooh, it's a bug and a poison site. Um, I want to... I guess I want to see you lay the smack down on this thing. As long as you get confused. Okay, SmackDown did nice work. Now, throw some rocks at it. Oh, now you just couldn't get confused. Oh, hey, hey you avoided the attack. Ha ha, sucker. And Salt Bay takes on his first trainer. Not bad. Good work, Salt Bay. Okay. 
And now he will move away. And the small oak will move away. That's the gym chest. I thought it didn't count for a sec there. I thought it was gonna it was gonna give me a VAR ruling and I wasn't it wasn't gonna count. Let's go to the VAR room. You know, ref gets on his little TV to see if I've actually if I've actually pushed it in or not. What a performance! I'm sure we can look forward to a great harvest festival next year. I'm happy to de declare your gym test officially cleared. Report to v uh, the lobby uh, at the gym uh, and good luck against your bar with Katie. All right. I mean, damn it. Why is this not a new route? This route is now populated with Pokemon. It's got Fido, it's got uh, a... There's a load of Jigglypuff about, but this is not a new route. So I can't count it. I can't run into any of these things. It's annoying, but it's the way it is. <laughs> Until you guys tell me otherwise, I don't really know what to do about that. I think after this episode, I'm gonna go and grind. I now got a level 20 in my box, and I know that Condorat, I know, I know that Bubble is level 17. Oh, Fizzle on. I was wondering what is up here. Right, I think we're ready for this. I'm gonna. I'm going to throw Bubble back in the front of the party. Welcome. Hey, yo. Welcome back, Joanne. I hear you were on a roll out there. A, a big congratulations from me on a successful clearing of the gym test. You've ensured your right to face the gym leader. Best of luck. Are you ready to face uh, Gym Leader Katie, the sugar bug? Yeah, I'm ready to face her. Very well, then allow me to show you to the battle court. Let's do this. Eat up, you cute little Vivalon. Oh, uh, what a lovely trainer you are. Thank you for your skillful olive rolling. It was quite impressive. Oh, did I forget to introduce myself? Forgive me. My name's Katie, and I am the owner of Pes... Uh, Pasterio Saltberry. Uh, Soapberry. That's right. Eight. I'm not in. When I'm not in my shop, I'm on duty as the Condorado gym leader. Forgive me. My name is Katie, and I am the uh, gym leader here at Condorado City. The main line 
of work is crafting sweets as a pastry chef. Little sweets uh, that bring happiness for just one bite. Bug type Pokemon uh, are hiding in the foliage. Both are sm uh, both are small and yet very powerful. Don't let your guard down unless uh, you would like to f uh, get knocked off your feet. <coughs> Do this. You have a nimble. I haven't even seen this Pokemon yet. Don't take my bug types lightly. You will be in a hold. You'll be in a world of pain too. I haven't even seen this Pokemon yet. I mean, that was kind of easy. I mean, salt uh, bubble is bubble is quite high leveled. Let's use salt bay on this next effort, uh, on this next bug, and then we'll bring out. Oh, oh, it's a tumbleweed Pokemon. Cotton, Trotron. Uh, yeah, I've seen this. I've seen this thing. Oh, come on, Salt Bay. This is not the time even for you to be missing. This is not the time, Salt Bay. You cannot miss two in a row. There we go, Salt Bay. You hit two in a, you miss two in a row, you hit two in a row. And Teddy Ursa is your final mon. Uh, this is going to be your ace, and this is going to terrestrialize. But it is raining. I don't like that. Oh, you're quite good, aren't you? How sh should I take you on? I am good. I am a little worried because it's raining right now, but... I know my little Pokemon tend to break free of your cocoon and, and come into battle. And apparently she can turn this... Uh, Teddy Ursa into a bug even though it wouldn't normally be a bug is it now a bug uh, <laughs> sorry <laughs> I mean I'm level 18 I'm three levels higher than you My sweet little Pokemon drop like flies. Your strength during our battle, uh, oh, like a nice, uh, was like a nice bread in an oven. I feel like I need to work on my own strength too, as well. Congratulations, you've passed. As proof of your victory, allow. Uh, me, allow me to present you with a gym badge. I hope you enjoy it alongside Aid a helpful helping with my deluxe handmade treats. With one ja a gym badge, Pokemon up to level 25 will be easier to catch uh, and listen to your commands as well. I see you've got you. Uh, you have quite an appreciation as an appetite as well. How about a little TM? Pa 
counts. Okay. If you use that TM in your travel, then you can make t you can make copies of it using the TM machine. Mm. I wish you luck on your little ventures. May the sweet uh, and lovely taste as well as dessert. Off you go until we meet again. Okay, so that was our first gym. Oh, can we get any call? Hey, uh, hey, Joanne. I just uh, had to tell you my Pokemon are pretty cool and I've learned some new moves. Be ready. Oh, how did the gym go, by the way? I passed. Yes! I mean... <laughs> I mean, it was pretty obvious you were going to pass, but congratulations. I'm so glad I encouraged you to take on the gyms. Nice job by me. Uh, nice job, past me. I'm training hard too. Uh, by the way, uh, a day, uh, be a night. Gonna give it all to boot. Thank goodness uh, you've got the map app. It, it tells you a ton of information about who you're fighting next. Especially in a huge place like Pandora. After all, the path to getting stronger has some strange stops on its and detours. Speaking of which, I wonder what Abian's up to. Anyway, catch up with you later. I'm sure we'll battle if we run into a way. So the, the game tells you to do all three. It's not just that the fact that you can do all three. The game tell the game is literally pushing you to do all three of the quests. I mean, I'm probably not ready to. Uh, I'm probably not ready to take on a. Uh, a gym like his, just uh, I mean, I'm probably not ready to take on a Titan just yet. But I will heal. And do. You know what? We're still early into this episode. Do you want to go and see if we can take on uh, the second gym test? I have one more of these. You know what? No. It's cheaper to do. V oh, there's there's a Titan there. That's the flying titan now. Uh, what I was gonna do? Where's Metagoza? I want to go to here, but I want to go to Metagosa first. Yeah. Okay. Nangelo Academy. Yeah, fly to the spot. Because I want to go to the store, go and get some more, uh, go and get some more soda pop, and then we'll go and do this. Uh, we'll go and take on the second gym test. Because, you know, truly open Pokemon game. Truly open Pokemon games so that we could probably take on another gym right now. But before we do that, let's head to the school store. Uh, 
And let's buy some soda pop. Okay. And then let's get some great balls too whilst we're here. Is there anything else we need? I mean, we could do with some like paralyzed heals, maybe. And maybe an, a few antidotes. You know, if we're going up against uh, a grass type gym, we're going to need uh, a ways of dealing with status ailments. But other than that, we should be ready for this. Let's do, let's head to the entrance hall and let's head onwards to a gym. I was thinking like, should I go and try and get close with my teachers? Because apparently there's some, if you get te if you get close to the teachers, something happens. I'm guessing things happen. Because I've been learning that you can get, cl you can get close to your teachers. You can, you know, you can befriend, uh, befriend them. Uh, befriend them. Don't know if that helps you in any way, shape, or form, but it's kind of interesting you can do that. So I'm kind of interested in seeing what that does. If you know, if it helps in any way, shape, or form. I want to go here. And then I want to take on the gym test. I don't know, I don't think we'll pass, I don't think we'll be taking on the gym today. I feel like that's what we might, I might do and do some grinding and uh, take that on in the next episode, at the very start of the next episode. But we can definitely take on the gym test so we'll definitely do that And here it is. Here's the gym. Let's go in. Joanne. It's so wild that you ended up a uh, uh Ran, did up visit, randomly visiting the same gym at the same time again. What a co weird coincidence! I swear I'm not sneaking ahead of you. Uh, uh, I can I can lie in wait and go. Oh, uh, oh wow, weird. I might uh, uh, might as well battle while we're here. No, no, seriously. Look uh, to prove it. I won't even challenge you to battle this time. Much as I'd like to, but uh, you and your Pokemon, they're definitely gotten stronger since the last time. Um, add these to the mix and they'll be 100% set to go. Ethers, thank you. I'll leave, save those for later. I'll be cheering on for you. i got to go and train my Pokemon 20, uh, 20 or so so I so can tackle the gym. Welcome to the Anazoria Gym. Let me register your Pokemon. Great. Now you'll be fair uh, in order to face Buffer uh, Bassius, you'll first need to pass the gym test. Here at the uh, Amazonia gym, you'll be competing in a game of some flora hide and seek. As you may know, uh, some f uh, Amazonian is the, is the city of artists. The artwork made uh, by the 
the people here is largely inspired by nature and the sun that nutri uh, nutrates it. Since uh, Sun Flora embody uh, this uh, concept, we try and gather them up and take good care of them. Today, your job is to uh, find some flora located throughout uh, Amazonian. Remember, these Pokemon look like sunflowers. Gather up ten of them uh, and bring them to the Sunflora lawn to pass the test. I'll register the Sunflora locations. Uh, some flora lawn location in your app. Okay, let's do it. Let's do it. Register these Sunflora locations. Is this the Sunflora lawn? Hi there. I look after the Sunflora lawn. Are you ready to take on the challenge? Yes, I'm ready to take on the challenge. Sounds like the Sunflora are ready too. And with that, the gym test begins. You found, uh, once you've found uh, 10 Sunfloras, bring them to me here at the Sunflora lawn. All right. Gym test. Seek out some floras. You found one some flora. Yay, I found one some flora. I mean, if they're going to be all around here like this, it's going to be easy. I've already found four. Five now. Uh, where else can I go for some flora looking? Uh, there's one right there. Six, seven. This is get. This is a bit easy. I will admit, and it is possibly uh, lagging out my game a bit. I will admit. Eight. And there's the tenth one right over there next to those stones. Okay, I can't ride a ride on here. Oh, I kind of want to go and see what that is. I'll bring them to the Sunflora Lawn. I will bring my ten Sunflora to the Sunflora Lawn. And then in the next episode, we will take on the bow. Hello, we have ten Sunflora here. That was pretty easy, I will admit. You passed! Well done on finding those Sunflora. You've passed the gym class with flying colours. Now, uh, please go back to the lobby and report uh, your results. 
I will do that in the next episode of our Pokemon Scarlet Nuzlocke. In the next episode, we will take on the Amazonia Gym. But until next time, I am Lantern Joe. Mean to the Pokemon get to Laza. Everybody get Pokemon. Good night! Thank you so much for watching. If you did enjoy this video, then please consider leaving a like, comment, and subscribing for more videos. And of course, if you ring the bell, you'll be notified first when those videos come out. You can follow me on Twitter at Lantern Joe, where you'll get news, thoughts, and opinions from me and the rest of the Lantern Nation. And of course, if you want to watch some more videos, there should be something in the top right and top left hand corner of this here end card. But until next time, I have been Lantern Joe, and I'll see you on the next video.